Hey there guys and welcome to today's adventure with Duck. We're here in the Geek Group Soundstage where we have a nice pretty box. This is the newest thing to arrive for our robotics lab and it is quite possibly the most unusual thing that we've ever had in a robotics lab so we're going to open it up for you guys. We were going to wait for the factory rep to get here because he's going to be giving us a tour on this but we're really eager and we want to see inside the box. So Mr. Kidwell, if you please. Thank you. Let's open the box. It's blue. Of course it's blue. Now, actually, Mikey, take the white out, and there will be a seam on the box somewhere. One of the corners of the box will be a seam. This is the seam. This is the seam. Okay. Um... We're going to cut, you cut right down this corner, right on the corner, and I'll cut down the other corner, and we'll just open the front. Okay? It is. It's beautiful. You good? good? Let's show the world. Okay. This is the new Clark Focus 2 20 inch floor scrubber with boost technology. It is brand new from the factory, donated by Clark. We'd like to thank them. And uh, this is the basis for one of our newest robotics projects for the 2009 season. And it is a beautiful piece of machinery. It's quite fabulous, and we're very much looking forward to playing with it. So let's, let's take a look. Doug, just be careful. The solution valve is closed, and the battery pack is unplugged. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Yes. This, is, this is supremely awesome. And you'll notice the, the thing that really sets it off is if you come down here and look, Mikey. Come here, Moose. You've had a lot of experience with our old floor scrubber. This doesn't have the rotating wheels. Oh, it's, a it's a flat pad, and it works like a, a random orbital sander. It looks so, like one of the green scrubby pads. Yeah, it, it looks a lot like that. And it, and it vibrates and does its thing. And this is the water line. It's that tiny. Now, is this some... The scrubbing part, is that something that we will have to replace? We can replace it, and I'm sure we will over time. And they, the white boxes, I'm pretty sure, contain extra pads. But this is, this is fabulous. This is an incredible bit of kit, and I'm happy to have it here. So we'd like to thank everybody at Clark for sending us a new toy. And our goal with this is we're going to modify this floor scrubber to work autonomously. We're going to put object avoidance, collision detection, all that jazz, um, and this is going to be a robotics project. So it's going to be pretty cool. So what do you, just initial thoughts, you've known about it for a whole five seconds. <laughs> what do you think of that idea? I have a radar unit we can put on the front. Yeah? Well, there you go. Ultrasonic. So, oh, okay, so it's an ultrasonic system. So it's more like sonar than radar, but yeah. Okay. Well, that's, that's exactly what I was thinking, was using a sonar type system. Um, and an onboard computer. And what? The speed thumb? Okay. The picture on it is a bunny. Well, yeah, there's probably a turtle on the other side. No, just, no, a, just bunny. a bunny. Okay. And it's got a switch here so, and a button here. I wonder what these two buttons do. I don't know. We'll have to read the manual yeah, and figure it out. Them down for it to go. But it's, it's so much nicer than, than the old one. It's got the chargers on board built into it, yep, so no separate charger. It's got a cup holder. It's got, which is really the important thing for yeah, Mikey, is it needs a cup holder. <laughs> I like it how it is, but the Roomba from hell? That's pretty much what we're making, is, is the Roomba from hell. You have Roomba issues, don't you? I'm very, very happy to have this. You have no idea. Oh yeah, this, this with the epoxy floors is going to make for an awesome building. It's really, it's, it's going to make for a dramatic improvement in, in the cleanliness of the lab, so we're, we're very happy. <laughs> well, we wanted to thank Clark 
So you guys have fun, and that's today's adventure with Doug. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.